tradition of Zionism in its most extreme form. Yes. Ethnic supremacy, dehumanization, apartheid, yeah. genocide, yeah. and mass slaughter yeah. under the guise of a political ideology. Let us be clear. The problem is not just Netanyahu or his government. It is the deep-rooted institutional and structural racism within the depths of Israeli society. Yeah. And it is manifested in the extreme right-wing government headed by Netanyahu that includes the likes of Ben Gvir and Smotrich. Yeah. This racism fuels the oppression, violence and apartheid inflicted upon Palestinians every single day. For far too long the world has turned a blind eye to the atrocities committed against the Palestinian people. The international community's response to the murder of 34,000 Palestinians and the ongoing genocide at the hands of Israel has been deafening silence. This is in stark contrast to the outcry when seven Western aid workers, including three Britons, were killed. The hypocrisy and the racism are clear. Ladies and gentlemen, we must go further in our demands. Israel has become a pariah state that does not respect international law and international norms. Our government and nations are
genocide in Gaza. They will be reading the names of the Palestinians who follow that for two minutes. At the end of that silence, we will read a poem. So please give a very warm welcome to the Indian